Challenge Bathurst was conceived in 2016 with the inaugural event held that year. Um, it was designed to complement the other events that happen at the Mount. So uh, obviously we have the Bathurst 1000, the Bathurst 12 hour and the Bathurst 6 hour. They're all racing events and endurance racing events. So we thought we'd introduce an event that would feed competitors into those events in the future by giving them an opportunity to get out on track in, in a spirited format. We had a good turnout in the inaugural year and it's grown every year until this year, thanks to COVID, but uh, the numbers are still very healthy this year. So I think we've got 368 competitors here this year and last year was the record year at 422. So it's a good result in the current environment. Look, it fits in nicely into the calendar. We've got, now got the, uh, the international event, hopefully, the inaugural event next year, which is supposed to be this year. So I think it'll stay in this November time slot. It sort of works well at the end of the year. And it, it gives uh, a lot of club level guys an opportunity to come and drive the circuit, a bucket list uh, item. And some of them get the bug after that, and then they step up into a racing category, and then maybe a higher racing category. So it's, it's almost like a feeder category, category into, into the racing industry but also for club level guys and girls just to tick it off their uh, bucket list. Oh, I, uh, I wouldn't run this event anywhere else. It's not that it couldn't succeed, it's just that Mount Panorama is so iconic that everyone wants to be here. Mount Panorama is an iconic circuit worldwide, probably top five circuits in the world. And so anyone who gets a chance to be here at this, and particularly at this level, just jumps at it.